This is breaking news. Don't think of idols as pushovers. 17 Sungkwon speaks out amid Hybe controversy. South Korean record giant Hybe has been facing backlash after a National Assembly audit disclosed controversial internal reports from the company. According to Korean media, the documents contained 18,000 pages of which only 2,000 were shown during the audit. It reportedly contained evaluations and derogatory remarks about several K-pop idols from TSM Entertainment, JYP Entertainment, IG Entertainment, and other agencies. Some of the comments were their plastic surgery was overdone, and other members are shockingly unattractive. Today, Op 29. Sungkwon from the boy band 17, who is signed with Pledis Entertainment of which Hybe is a majority shareholder, broke his silence with a lengthy Instagram post. While the 26-year-old didn't directly mention names, netizens have taken it to be a response to the situation regarding Hybe. I don't want to see any more hurtful exchanges. While seeing all the things that have happened so far, I've been working hard with the members like I always have with the mindset that it will somehow pass, he said. But seeing how these situations are hurting my fans, members, and others, I feel like I can't stay silent anymore. Sung Kwan then detailed his experience as an idol, writing his heartfelt thoughts on the ups and downs. Being an idol is my chosen profession. I receive a lot of love, so there are some things I have to endure. But I don't believe this is a job where we should suffer to the point of being eaten away by it, he said. He also remarked in his statement, I want to say this clearly. We are people who have endured pain and collapse and have fought hard to show our best selves to our fans on stage. I hope you don't think of idols as pushovers. He also spoke on behalf of his peers. You have no right to belittle our narratives, not just us, but other artists as well. We are not your items. I hope you don't think you can use us as you please. Sungkwon concluded on a heartwarming note and told fans that he's sorry and he loves them. If we all treat each other with warmth, I think things can get better. My earnest wish is that we stop hurting each other in ways we can't be responsible for. His fellow members showed their support in the comments section. Just like you said, I hope this world becomes one that is filled with warmth, said Wanwu, 28. I hope everyone is a little bit happier, wrote 29-year-old Scoops. Vernon, 26, dropped a heart emoji, while soloist and former one own member Kang Daniel, who turns 28 in December, commented, True, love wins all. Hybe CEO apologizes. Hybe CEO Lee Jo Sang released an official statement on their official website today, expressing his sincere apologies. He claimed that the internal reports were created to gather public sentiments on industry trends and issues, but acknowledged that the contents were very inappropriate. He also apologized to all the artists, including those from other agencies, who were mentioned in the document. We are also reaching out to each agency individually to offer our apologies directly. Additionally, I am also sincerely extending an official apology to all the artists of Hyde Music Group who have been subjected to criticism due to the company, he said. He added that they stopped creating such monitoring reports and promised to establish guidelines and strengthen internal controls so the situation doesn't reoccur.